welcome back and today I'm participating in the Divas DIY Glam Series 2019 and this collaboration is being hosted by Elaborate Designs by Aisha and Diva Decorating. So we are to decorate something in our home and it must be either shiny, blingy or mirrored. So for me, I have been updating my um, bathroom with a little glam. So I decided I wanted to update this mirror right here, the edges around it and give it a little bit of bling. And the items that I'm going to be using is this uh, designer's glitter tape made by art skills and i picked it up at my local uh, dollar general and you can see it's really blingy and it does come in a variety of colors it comes in uh blue gold silver they even have buffalo check and it also just comes in white with a white glitter so I'm going to be using this to bling out my mirror. So what you're going to want to do first is measure how much tape you're going to need. And so this is about one and a quarter. And it's one and a quarter all the way around. And... The strips are 28 inches long. By 22 inches wide. So what I'm going to do is start out by cutting strips of tape. So I'm going to pre-cut the strips of tape and then I'm going to come back and you can watch me apply it. So after opening opening up the tape, I notice that once you peel it off, like any type of duct tape, it's sticky. I thought it would be on the paper backing and I can cut it. So what I would have to do is get up on, let's see, get this started get up on the ladder put my first piece exactly where I want it Now for this project, I did buy four rows, which I don't think that I will need all four of the rows. So you can see this is what the first strip is looking like, and I'm going to have to come down the side or actually I can fold it around let me just cut that off so then I'm gonna just fold it now you can even do this with um, bling wrap if you like and just get some two-sided tape which I had done on a different mirror but I like this it gave off a little bit more um, shiny and blinginess so that's the first side then I'm going to come over here and try not to knock the camera over now 
Now this side I'm going to have to square it up. Hope I make an even cut there. You want to get it as precise on the mirror as you can. And it's going to be different for everyone depending on the type of mirror you're covering. And I am really so glad that I decided to use this tape again. Um, I like the shininess of it. better than I did with the bling wrap. And the good thing about this, because it's tape, if you think you didn't get it on good enough, you can just peel it off. And I can see now I am not going to need all four rolls, but I'm not going to take them back to the store. I'm probably going to keep them and use them for another project. So as you can see, let's see, if I turn the light off, you can't really see that. So I'll get you a close up when I'm done. So this is what it's starting to look like. So far and it actually looks like I'm only gonna need the one roll which is great I can find a lot of projects for the other three rolls so now for this bottom half I'm just going to measure it all the way across Do I want to go all the, all the way across? I was going to let it overlap, but I don't think I want it to overlap. So I'm going to go all the way across. And I'm going to actually cut two strips because I'm going to cut a strip for the top. almost one roll. I'm almost at the end of the other roll. And I will be doing my um, husband's mirror just so that it will match. Again, you want to try to get it as squared as possible. And then again, I'm just going to pull it off, line it up, up under the mirror, and just go all the way across. There you go, and then I'm just going to tuck this underneath. Now I'm going to do the upper part, and I will take you guys in for a closer look. But um, you can see, uh, unfortunately, the light leaves off some glare. But you can see how beautiful and blingy 
that's starting to look. I want to see how it's going to hold up with uh, steam in the bathroom. And then I realized I didn't have my camera light on. Ugh, silly me. So I want to see how it's going to hold up with um, steam in the bathroom. So let's get that started. Get up on the ladder here. Repeat the same. Repeat the same process. Now it's a little difficult up under up under the light, but I am going to get it. There we go. I got that piece on. So if you're going to be doing this and you have light covers over your light bulbs, you might want to take the light covers off and maybe do it in the daylight where you don't actually need the light on. So if there's some buckles, I may just, in the morning, take the light covers off, pull the tape off, and reapply it. Because again, it's, it's duct tape, so... little piece right there. Should have had some music on doing this but there you have it um a blinged out mirror and i'm gonna take you in for a closer look so here you go a uh, blinged out mirror and if it seems like the tape is trying to um, peel off you can just add a little bit of um hot glue i wouldn't add e6000 in case you decide you want to maybe change the color of the glitter uh for the summer but here it is so this is my um glam blinged out shiny glittery mirror and i am actually loving that i love how that glitter is uh, reflecting that is so pretty you see that that is absolutely gorgeous that's gonna make me well I had actually did my trash can with bling wrap but I'm going to take it off and use the tape and it goes great with my um blinged out accessories I've done uh, another time I did those a while back so what do you think guys do you think it came out nice do you think that you would try this 
I'm just absolutely in love with it. There you go. So I want to thank Diva Decorating and Elaborate Designs by Aisha for hosting this Divas DIY Glam Series 2019. And this is my first project for my bathroom. I probably have about three more uh, DIYs that I want to do in the bathroom to give it a little more glam and once I do that then I will actually um, put my accessories, shower curtains, um, washcloth towels, things of that nature and give you a bathroom tour. So if you are not subscribed to my channel please subscribe, leave me a comment, give me a thumbs up and share this video. And as always, stay blessed and have less stress in your life. Bye.